Welcome back to Age of Empires 2, The Conquerors, and welcome to the third scenario for Attila the Hun, The Walls of Constantinople. By this time, the Romans had considerable experience dealing with barbarians. They could civilize the raiders to some extent by offering them otherwise useless land on the Roman borders as a token tribute. Before Attila, this tactic seemed to be working on the Huns, who settled on the Danube River Valley. All that changed when Attila seized command. He was much more aggressive and unpredictable than the previous Hunnic kings. He demanded that the tributes from Rome be increased. And when the Romans refused, Attila marched on the Eastern Roman Empire. He marched on the great city of Constantinople, whose double walls had never fallen. Attila was done with raiding. Now the Huns advanced slowly, eradicating everything in their path. The Romans would reinstate the tribute, or they would be destroyed. And here we go. Let's ring the town bell right away, because we have to fend off some of these guys here. We are going to try and bait them towards our town center here because we don't want to lose our mill. There we go. Just come down here. Just come down here. Let's see whether we can steal this guy here. And oh, there was a mistake. Well, I guess we just come in here now. That's okay. You get back in here. I didn't mean to empty this completely. I just meant to... Come on. There we go. That's better. And now these guys here are dead anyway. So that's said and done. Let's ungarrison everyone. You will go through the mountains here because there will be a relic. And we're also going to build one, two, three, four, five, six of you. And we probably want some more some more lumber. But we also have a good amount of lumber right now, so we're probably just going to produce more villagers. And we're going to use some fields here as well so our goal is not to wipe out absolutely everyone on this map here instead we just have to extort enough gold from the romans which we will do but first we have to get our stuff up and running let's get the field here and you can actually build me a monastery let's do just that there's some more guys here loitering around let's see what you do you can go south i've got plans for you Huh, I'd hoped you could actually wander through there, but I guess you can't. Disappointing, but acceptable. You, whatever, just, just ignore that guy. Hey, sheep. I guess you can walk up here if you really want to. And you will look for a monastery here. So we're going to destroy that. That's going to give us some food. That's not going to give us, okay, get in here because evidently this guy here, was he just scouting? Maybe he's just scouting. Never mind. There we go, this is what I want. You carry that relic there. And we have to defend ourselves against various factions here, but thankfully these green guys here are pretty weak. They don't really send anything particularly scary against us. And you here can bring this back to the monastery. And you, I guess you can work on this sheep here as well. You are just going to hang around here and you're going to murder all of these, these guys here. And in the meantime, we are also going to send you over there. And you can start... Oh, man, there's so many of these guys in my backyard here. It's really not convenient. Anyway. Okay, there's many scouts here and whatnot. Okay, all of, you just, all of you just die, please. Thank you. In the meantime, you will establish me a lumber camp. Maybe just here. Yeah. Should be close enough, but not super close. And you will... Let's get let's get two more of you. I just I just want some of you for healing purposes. And you are also hanging around here. You can you can get me some more lumber as well. So Constantinople is here. This map looks a little bit similar to the one from the Barbarossa campaign, but it's not identical. And there's various other cities here. And we're going to raise their stuff. And if we raise stuff and threaten the Romans, then we're going to get gold. So let's get couple of you here and we're also going to get a couple more knights just hang around here so we can ok 
can secure our border there. You are... What are you going to do? Yep. We went full Scrooge McDuck here. Gold is all that counts in this mission here. So we are regener ooh, regenerating. We are generating some gold now because we have that relic. That's useful. Oh, hey there, scout. You're just going to hang around here and you'll be annoying. I don't want that. So we're going to destroy these guys here soon enough. You can come over here to help help me with the healing. And it looks like you guys are done for now. So you just, just destroy this guy here. I don't want these guys here waddling over the map. Uh, let's get this upgrade here. Let's get some of these. And then let's have, just have you hang around here. You can join, you can just join these guys here, it doesn't really matter too much. And you hang around there. Anything else I want? I probably want a couple more workers. Just to, is there still, oh there's still someone inside. That's okay with me. You can maybe build me, what else do I want? Probably a siege workshop. Yeah, let's just build one now, so I have one for later. But then again, yeah, yeah let's, let's get one now. There we go, good enough. You can also get this upgrade here. And we don't have enough lumber for that, but that's okay. I guess you can get me some more lumber then. And you guys should be sufficient to defend me here for the time being. Yeah, you need to save gold here, but you need so much gold that it's not really worth trying to save what little you have in the beginning. So don't worry about that too much. You can help setting up the siege workshop here, or you can just bump into that other worker and not do that. That's okay too. Let's convert you. Or let's at least try. Nope, that's a resistance scout. That's okay. You're not worth the effort here. Awesome. Then we want maybe two more of you to get me lumber here. Then let's get the lumber upgrade to get more lumber. Yeah, these guys here only send fairly weak stuff, so we don't really have to worry about them too much. We want a cup. Okay, don't, don't have enough lumber for that, obviously. Don't know why I was even trying that. Let's also see that we maybe get the the cart here. And any more buildings we want right now. I guess we could get the like, university. Actually, no, we cannot. How about a... We do have a blacksmith, so never mind. Never mind. Instead, maybe you guys can actually try to get through that gate because they don't have anyone who's arranged. And we have a couple of Tarkans here. Then maybe we can just make our way through there. Then again, do we even have to destroy the gate? Because we can probably just destroy one of the wall segments here, but I'm not quite sure whether these have the same defense. I know they have different hit points, but I know there's there's a couple of hidden stats in this game here, and they just keep building these guys here, and it's it's very mildly annoying, but not too bad. Monk hit points, uh, yeah, why not? And we also want this upgrade here. There we go, and you can destroy this gate here. It's going to take a while, but that's okay. And it's open anyway. Oh wait, they just sent someone through there. I was just wondering what happened there, but never mind. Okay. Don't get inside, because I don't want anyone to be trapped on the other side. That would just be annoying. And yeah, you, you send your scouts. I'm afraid they don't stand a true chance against my knights here. Speaking of whom, I guess we can also kill your workers here. Why not? May as well harm your economy a little bit. Let's get some upgrades here, like this one here. And you just continue to attack this. They sent more of these guys here out, but that's all right. Let's maybe get some battering ram, oof, I guess. Wait a second. No, oh yeah, we don't have enough gold. That's okay. I'm going to get to that soon enough. Get through here. Kill this guy here, and yeah, we're going to get get through this one here. It's a relative ease, even without battering rams. And you can nevertheless help out here. And then we're going to blow up their stuff. You do get a good amount of gold for destroying that town center, but I'm not quite sure whether you can just do that multiple times, like wait for them to rebuild their town center. Maybe you can get in here, just because, and for the speed bonus. A town patrol, no, that does cost gold. Let's not bother with that right now. There we go. 
you you just attack that wall there randomly that's okay uh, just just come back for a moment here and get yourself healed or you come over here because the battle ram is so damn slow doesn't look like they're attacking us from this direction here much so let's just send you over here and have you join group one here other than that we seem to be doing well we're really only like lacking lacking gold here which is a somewhat big we're lacking but that's okay uh, yeah this one here not a problem everything that costs llama and food is not really much of an issue okay i guess we're going to get more of you then and you just start raising stuff here hey there hunter what do i want you for do we need more food maybe i need some more food because i did get a lot from destroying that monastery there so i shouldn't rely on reserves here exclusively you get in here Okay, uh, don't get don't get yourself town centered for now. There we go. Let's destroy the mill here instead. And can we afford another one? We can afford another one, so let's get that. You just take a step back here. Oh, you're trying to rebuild that. That's okay. You're going to fix that soon enough. Just kill their workers here. Okay, then take a step back. And I think you can already assault this town center here because I don't think the town center is going to be able to destroy a ram here in time. You can come over here for some healing and whatnot. And I guess you can also take over some more units here because we may as well may as well get get some free archers while we can. You just hang out here and destroy more workers who don't even care. Oh, now they care, but that's okay. And you, yeah, as I said before, you come over here. Anything else? Not really. Do you want this one here? Probably, but we need some more, some more stuff for that. Oh, and I heard the I heard the dreaded fearless exhausted sound, and that's because I didn't queue up any lumber here. So that should do it for now. We still have 400 left. That seems seems to be sufficient. This actually does a lot more damage to this than I thought it would, but that's okay. You take this guy here over. Let's just send everyone over there, and it's going to be fine. And this scout here will be mine, I think. There we go, finally. Okay, and... Oh yeah, there we go. Well, it might not be enough, to be honest. The 3,000 gold, that's pretty good. That's probably enough to get all the upgrades and whatnot what I want. But we're still going to kill all these guys here, I'm afraid. Do we even have access to markets in this mission here, I wonder? Well, seems to be some gaps in our tech tree there. Or well, the stuff what we can build, but never mind. You can return home for now. You can, I guess you can just hang around here and... Then again, do I want you to destroy some of the buildings? Yeah, let's do that instead. And you just murder everybody else here. And once we're done with you, we will turn our attention to the south. We're also going to get a couple more battering rams. And yeah, otherwise we seem to be doing fine here. Let's get... Oh, ooh, they actually... Oh, they sent these guys here. I don't really like that, to be honest. Then again, where are you? What are you actually doing? Then again, these guys... Wow, these guys... Are these really that weak? I mean, I know they are... They're a little bit of a like a very basic unit, but I didn't expect these guys to go down like that. You know what? Whatever. If you want to want to join my main army, there be my guest. I know only like the big buildings give you stuff, like the marketplace and whatnot. But let's see whether the dogs give us anything. They only have a couple of. Are we attacked by? Oh, great. Okay. not really what I want so you guys you know what just just kill these guys here as annoying as they are. thank you just just die okay and you can destroy this dock here you have destroyed our shipyards we will pay you 500 gold to cease these attacks I'm afraid I can't do that because I still need more gold. Anyway, you hang around here. And you guys here can go back to work. 
You can actually build me another lumber camp here. I do have a, a ton of lumber, but you what? You never know when you need more lumber. And you go and help out here as well. Yes, it looks like the shipyards do give you gold. It doesn't seem like destroying the basic houses gives you anything, but we're going to do it anyway. Just because we can. You gather here. Well, the answer is no, probably. But just stop it here, okay? Okay, you, you chase this guy here. Maybe I just, uh, should just pop a, a tower down here. Let's maybe just get like one tower here. I just should really scout the area better before we do that, but never mind. So I do have some stone here. I guess that's somewhat convenient to mine. I think I can send some of you guys down there. Because we don't really need that many guys on lumber, as it seems. So let's do just that. There we go. Well, this guy here... Thank you. Finally. Okay, come down here, please. You release these fellows here. And someone can fix my, my battering ram here. And you come over here. Form a nice army, get yourself healed, and then you can patrol my, my border here. Okay, everything is fine so far. Yeah, destroy that monastery down here. It gives you a thousand food. That's a huge boon in the beginning. Seems the other ones here are undamaged. That's nice. There we go. You just hang around here, even though I guess I do have these guys to patrol the area now, so it's not super necessary to have a tower there. But you know what? It, it calms gold shaft mining. I'm not sure whether you even have any gold to mine on this map here. We shall see. In any case, what we're going to do next is do some scouting with these guys here. You can... I guess you can just go back. Or you could also build some other buildings, such as the university. And... Oh! Lone Pike guy here. That's okay. You're dead now. Can we convert the horses? No, we cannot. Oh, hell. Oh, no, 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 no. Not going to have that. Well. well I guess you have to die now. That's how it is. Also, got some more sheep here. You come over here then. There's some more stone here as well, just in case we need it. So let's see. You know what? You can already follow us, because you're all so slow that if I ever want you down here, I should probably send you out sooner rather than later. Let's just destroy these towers here. There we go. We have a university. Anything else we want right now? Not really, I think. Uh, to be honest, you can probably slaughter the sheep here. Because why not? And... Murder holds. Uh, we might want these later. Oh yeah, don't have enough stone for that. That's okay. So there's that town center. Let's maybe... Um, okay, so the is already out of control. So let's just take a step back here. That's a little, kind of a lot of guys. So let's go, go back to our monks here. And then we're just going to jump these guys here and hopefully exterminate most of what they have here. I know these, these guys are the counter, but at the same time, they're also not particularly powerful. So I'm not too worried here. These guys also have crossbow men. Those are, of course, annoying. But what you also want is to destroy this cart here. There we go. Now this guy here is our guy. Can take a step back and you try to destroy these guys here because they are just annoying. So always just take a step back. You get over here. You kill that guy. You come over here. And I don't know, you just get in here. For the time being, you just heal up my guys a little bit. After we kill you. Mm, I'm probably just going to send you in there and then... And I guess I should probably get some cavalry archers. Because fighting these guys like this is really annoying. Let's maybe do that. We do have... Nope. What? Really? Do you have to walk past me here and then do shenanigans like this? Whatever. You just 
you just build me a, an archery range here. Let's see whether this guy actually attacks me because it could just be a scout. Anyway, we have you cornered, so that's that's good. There we go. And I don't know why I didn't build that archery range earlier, but never mind. Also, did I really lose one of these guys? I guess I did. It's unfortunate, but that's how it is. Okay, so you heal all of these guys here. And we'll have to see whether whether they can send all that much more after us or whether they can just go for their town center soon. We probably can. If we have four battering rams close by, that's going to give us a nice... Nice damage boost. And they don't seem to be interested in building all that much ranged units. It seems to be all that many ranged units. They seem to be more interested in building these guys here. Okay, let's get maybe two more. That's not what I want to do. Two more monks here. You go back to slaughtering sheep. And... Mm -hmm. Oh, that actually costs only food and wood, so we can afford that without having to think about it too much. Good, good. So let's maybe come a little bit closer and see whether we can just take down their town center. You can actually complete this entire scenario here without going after Constantinople itself at all, at least directly. But we probably have to do it if we spend too much gold on other stuff, so it's likely, but that's kind of how it's designed anyway, so that's not a, it's not exactly a fail stat. Let's wait for the second guy here to be ready. Any more? I guess we want these upgrades then. They're not that expensive anyway. So you just destroy this, I say just destroy this town center. You come over here in the meantime. Just be on standby. Lots of wild horses here. So we can, can protect you from the inevitable pikemen. Nope, scout, don't do that. Let's maybe get into a defensive stance here. So let's see how much they have still left to send after us. More monks have been created. Nice, nice. So you can join us down here. Hmm, okay. Expect a little bit more here. I thought they would, would just await me with a little bit of an army here, but that doesn't really seem to be the case. Okay. Well, I guess not then. Man, you, you better think of something. Otherwise... Oh, yeah, there we go. That's one guy. That should be... All. Okay, so there's their army. That's That's fine. These guys here, even if they destroy a couple of the, the things we have here, it's not that big of a deal and that town center is almost gone anyway. I don't think they ever rebuilt that because they seem to become dormant afterwards. So you come down here. So just to be sure, let's murder their villagers. You never know when you don't want them to be in your way. Oh, oh, there's still a guy left here. Didn't even see that. There we go. You need to go as well, I'm afraid. And you will join my monk team here. Let's destroy that. There will also be another relic here. So you know what? Since we will have two of these soon, let's maybe get further here. So our monks hurry up a little bit. You will destroy the rest of the base defense here. They have some towers hanging around here. They're not super important to destroy, but one of them guards a relic, and we definitely want a second relic here. Relics can be quite valuable because you can just store them in your monastery and they generate income for you without really having to think about it. It's not that much, but it's just nice to, to have this passive income without really having to do anything for it. Hmm, where are the other towers, I wonder? Anyway, you just destroy this marketplace here. Yeah, it seems these factions here go completely dormant once you once you destroy their town center. So you probably can't just, uh, just uh, destroy their town center, wait for them to rebuild it and then destroy it again and then get 3000 gold every time. That will be a little bit cheap probably. So, you just destroy that. There should really be, or maybe you do that, because there should really be more towers and stuff here. But these guys, you're a little bit too slow to actually... There we go. So, uh, you know what, you can destroy that too. It's not that strong. And I still have two Tarkins left. So yeah, let's make sure that we destroy everything here as well. You destroy that marketplace here. You convert this worker here, because why not? We give you 500 more gold. 
Will you cease these raids? Well, I can't really decide. We'll, we'll really have to see here. For now, the answer is no. Also, there was only 500 gold, so... You gave me 3000 for destroying the town center, so don't be... Don't get stingy now, okay? Anyway... Let's throw a bunch more of you. Do I want some cavalry archers? How expensive are these? These do cost some gold. Uh, let's just finish, finish the cleanup here. You explore a little bit here, and then we'll see what, what else we do. I know I don't need to wipe out these villagers here, but it feels like the right thing to do. Look at that. So there is another relic here, and they also have their barracks here. Okay, so let's just see whether the air is clear. Seems to be the case. So monks, you can come over here with your improved movement speed, hopefully, and pick up the relic, and then... Hours later, it will be back at my base. And we should get a couple more of you queued up because we have a lot of lumber. We have a lot of we have a lot of food as well. But I just don't want to spend too much because a lot of stuff I'll spend will also cost me... I don't know, you just convert this person here. Will also cost me... As we can heal that work here while we're at it. Will also, will also cost me gold. I don't want to spend too much. I know I have a ton of gold and... I can spend a couple hundred, but at the same time, I don't want to want to overspend here. In any case, so with these factions here out of the way, the whole thing will also become a little bit easier for us. You can relic pick up. Do I really need anything else? If anything, I probably need more lumber. I mean, I don't really need more lumber right now, but I have more food and whatnot. So yeah, let's just go with that. Also, because I'm not really spending all that much. They did start you out with a good amount of resources here so you don't really need to worry about resources all that much unlike in the uh, last scenario where you don't start with much because you're supposed to pillage everything but also don't give you many workers and whatnot and you don't have any starting buildings and whatnot okay so let's destroy this one here yeah we're going to send these guys here home that's a trade car I just thought it was a demolition ship for one second that would have been a little bit out of out of place but never mind so we cannot age up anyway so let's not worry about that town patrol nobody cares and yeah why are you not destroying the stock here as i ordered you i don't know but hopefully this gives us even more resources but it seems we have mostly exhausted our our source of gold here so we could i guess we could just wait even though i'm not sure whether the gold you gather through a relic actually counts or whether you have to gather the legitimate way through looting and pillaging. Okay, the get Huns are attacking the docks at Philippopolis. Can nothing be done about them? Well, it's not really all that much left of that city anyway, so I wouldn't be too concerned about the docks here. In any case, you come up here, you will very slowly bring that over here. And you have actually not been doing anything for the for the last 10 minutes or so, so you just repair that. Okay, there doesn't seem to be anything left here, apart from some fish traps. I don't think there's anything of interest here, or you guys are just hanging out here. We can see. I don't think there's much here, but let's just explore a little bit. A blacksmith. Does it get me anything? Well, we'll find out. There's an odd spot for a blacksmith, but never mind. So there we go. That will double our relic income. And now we actually get... One unit of gold, not not even every second. We get it quite swiftly, so that's that's quite nice. So we don't need that much more gold, but if you want to assault Constantinople, we'll have to we we'll have to prepare properly. So let's do just that, and let's get a bunch of you here. Also, you can build me some of these buildings here, just so we can produce stuff faster. And yeah, you're going to produce me some of these guys here six seven eight for now let's see whether this gets us anything nope but you know what never mind i don't regret it awesome then let's just check for upgrades here but i think we got all of these here we did 
Let's queue up more fields. You guys here killed those guys, nicely done. And you can return home as well. And let's actually get a couple of you built here as well. And do we want, yeah. So we want a couple of these guys here to build us a castle at one point. But let's scout a little bit first. And we may as well use our actual scout for that. And you know what, I think I am going to get Town Patrol. Somerset would be nice, that's a lot of deer. So let's see, there's some outposts here. Yeah, this is very similar to the city as we've seen it in the Barbarossa campaign. So there's some guys here, there are some gates. We are not equipped for a direct siege, though perhaps we can destroy their locks. Yeah, you can build a navy of your, uh, of your own, and the docks actually give you, I think, something like 2,000 gold per, per dock. So it's a, it's a very decent amount. Whether or not that's worth that remains to be seen. In any case, what we're going to do for now is we're going to withdraw our food guys here, because we have a ton of food, so we don't really need to worry about that too much. And the good thing about... Constantinople is that I don't think they build anything or they don't build much so anything that gets destroyed is probably going to stay dead and could you please thank you thank you for staying and fighting so you could get yourself killed I do appreciate it so we have a bunch of these guys here now let's just group all of you here adequately and hey so you can immediately go into combat here There we go. And let's see. They'd also have siege weapons guarding their, their base. That's not so cool because those are obviously mobile. But yeah, well, we'll get to that. Okay. Oh, oh, snap. Okay, you know what? That's actually not so bad. Because at least we can fight that here now under our conditions. But we need to retreat afterwards because these mangonels here. Oh, retreat. They're just dealing too much damage. Okay, you kill this, these guys here. I actually want to build a castle and then lure everyone into castle white, but it looks like I'm not going to do that today, but that's okay. You know what? Uh, I can... Oh! No, 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 we're not going to play that game. Come over here. You will have to take that guy out first. Everything else is it's just not going to work out in our favor. Oh snap, there's two of them. So we, we can can hit and run them, but at the same time, that's kind of kind of a mess. Okay. Just split you up here. Probably need some more cavalry here soon anyway. Just just destroy them. Thank you very much. Okay, I lost a bunch of guys here. That's fine. Let's get a couple that's not a it's not a stable. Let's get a couple more of you here. If we have to invade the city anyway and destroy a bunch of their their, their stuff, then then we're going to get a ton of gold. Therefore one on the city that's worth I think five thousand, so half of what we need anyway. So, you just heal all of these guys here, so we have some, some backup, and, oh snap, man, stop just there with your siege engines here. Then again, you know what, if you want to send everything after me now, uh, be my guest. Okay, this is good now, are you done for the time being, or, or not, let's see. Okay, seems we're good, good here for now, so let's just have you do some more healing. You will join these guys here. And almost there. There we go. So you will have to hang around here because we don't want to risk all of our monks or workers getting hit there straight away. After they start building the castle, that will be a little bit of a waste, even though we do have plenty of lumber. There's no need to completely waste it. Okay. You will build me a castle, maybe right right here. Sounds like a plan. Yeah, you can destroy this outpost here because it mildly annoys me. You come over here. And there we go. These aren't really doing much damage, but they're nevertheless annoying. So you want you down here as well. And did we get all the relevant university upgrades here? We did not get any of the relevant university upgrades here. That's okay. 
So they have... They do have their super cavalry in their... In their castle there, so in their... Just in their city. And they do have a castle as well and stuff, so we have to be a little bit careful. But we should be fine. Built a castle on Roman land. Let us send them 500 gold as a sign of goodwill. Yep, you just get, keep sending that gold. Okay, so we're going to just destroy these outposts here. These guys here, yeah, feel free to run into my castle here. One barrage and you are done. There we go. And just in case, we're also going to build another stable here, because why not? Because it's marginally closer than the other one. You join us here. And let's see... I mean, I guess I could just send these guys here against the gates. So how, how expensive are you guys here? 60 gold. You guys here cost... You actually cost more gold. Hmm. But I don't think it's necessarily better to send you out. We'll, we'll have to see. In any case, you may as well... I guess you... Some of you may as well come in here to just to strengthen the castle a little bit. Because I don't really need you to, to get me that much more food. Unless... There we go, so we do have enough space for that. But let's maybe get like three of you back to the fields. Just so we have some food income. Awesome, so now need a plan to... You know what, let's just assault the castle gate and let's see whether they send more stuff after us. In the meantime, we're going to build a couple more of you. Okay, so the towers here attack us. So there's a whole bunch of them, even though they're not that strong, but this is nevertheless going to be annoying. Oh damn, I'm being converted, so let's not do that. You know what, yeah, let's see whether these guys here come after us. So we can... can passive-aggressively kill them. And if so, then we can maybe send battering ramps at one point. I just want to avoid that I just, like, march in there and get everyone killed. But, woo, these guys here, oh. Vicious. Even the attacks that aren't particularly aimed at any specific crossbow men here almost murder all of them here huh. so you here you know what I think I'm going to kill you now because I'm afraid that's necessary yeah I don't want to want to get anyone here con converted that's just annoying also do I want let's maybe get murder holes instead really not only did that guy c convert one of you, but you also... Really? Whatever. Okay, just someone just killed this guy here, okay? There we go, thank you very much. Then let's just return. And it seems like they ran out of guys to send after us here directly, which is nice. So we're going to send the battering rams in. And you, I guess we can convert you, but I think you're probably going to die before that happens. Yep, that sure happened. Awesome. So you guys here can now knock down the gate. We're going to knock down the gate first. Then we're going to go after the towers. Now the towers here should not do much damage against you. If they send guys out in the meantime, then I guess that happens. But it's going to be fine. Just slowly crawl. Oh, really? There's another guy here already? Okay, fine. I'm going to send my entire cavalry battalion after you also. Oh, hoo, 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 you came into range here. That was a big mistake. My friend, you should not have done that. Anything but coming into the range of that castle. Yeah, so the Constantinople has these double walls here. You know what? We're actually going to send one of you down here and one of you down there. I don't think we need that many to just tear down the gates. And these towers, like, they're getting kind of annoying this time, so let's just... Make sure we at least reduce their number, because they're not super strong, but the damage does add up over time. And the gate here is going down quite nicely. And boom, there we go. Then let's see what they send after us after we actually destroy these gates here. But the good thing is, that where, what, are, what are you guys here doing? Please. I know you're, you're siege ramps, but come on. Oh! Oh snap! 
So these guys, so you is going to retreat here because these guys are completely going to destroy. I see. Oh. Oh, you know what? You, you try to. Okay, so that guy here actually survived. Oh yeah, you came into castle range. Ah, uh, you know what? Let's let's just retreat here, and let's see whether we can. Oh, let's not do that. Ah, uh, shame that you couldn't kill this one here, but that's that's okay. You just take a step back here. You will heal this guy here. I don't think we have a range upgrade for these guys, do we? No, we only have this one here. So otherwise, this would have been nice to just get get the attention of those guys. Maybe we can lure you down here because these cataphracts here. Uh, if I don't have to fight you the direct way, maybe I'm just not going to do that. You gonna gonna come down here? Yep, you are at least some of you. So let's just have you run into my castle here and then get yourself slaughtered mercilessly. And you can even try to to steal one of these guys here, even though I don't think it's going to work. Oh, well, maybe not. These these guys might also have might also have the convert or die upgrade. But never mind. So that actually went pretty well. We're going to get you guys out of here because we, we don't desperately need need you as as a garrison there. And I want you to heal these guys here. And we're also going to build a couple more of you. Yeah, this isn't actually all that bad. I thought they would send more stuff earlier, but it seems they just run out of breath really quickly, which is actually kind of nice. Yeah, let's just do this slowly and systematically and everything's going to be just fine. How much hit points do you have left? Uh, too many. So we have to crack the second gate here. Let's do, do just that. And to be honest, those cataphracts, those might have been their best and last units anyway. So let's see. And you just hang around here and do nothing. And nope, don't do that. I wish you guys were faster. But then again, if, if you were really fast, then you'd be completely overpowered. Also, look how many resources I have. But gold is all I need. I know I'm being attacked by Constantinople. That just happens all the time. Yeah, it's no worries. We're going to come for you. Sooner or later. There we go. Just destroying this gate here. What are you guys... Why are you going down there? That's that's just not necessary. It is not necessary. There's... Whatever. You know what? I'm, I'm not going to micromanage every single battering ram here. Just not worth the effort. And... Boom. There we go. Awesome. So as soon as we break through here, we're just going to have these spread out and destroy more of these towers here. And we'll see whether anyone comes after us. You can come down here and you will join us here. Awesome. So you get up here. You can come over here, over there, over there and over there. See, this is it's enough towers for everyone. Amazing. Yeah, I think that town might already be mostly empty. But you, you have to protect me here a little bit. Then we're also going to empty... Oops, that's not what I want to do. I'm going to empty this for support. Oh, they have more siege weapons here. Um, you know what? It's not actually that big of a deal, but you have to kill this guy here. So they do have more stuff left than I thought. But it's not that big of a deal. Okay, just, just kill this guy here. Kill that guy here. Uh, you can join us here as well and you are not going to fight that guy because that guy is behind gates and stuff and i'm just not i'm not even going to bother with that so you instead destroy this one here let's see what if there we go see just just come close and we can be friends you destroy this one here you come over here as well okay i have a bunch of these guys here left that's okay you just retreat for a little bit of healing And then we're going to wipe out you guys. And you can help me out against these fellows. Yeah, it's going to be fine. That tower's almost dead. Yeah, my cavalry here is taking quite some damage, but it's okay. We have murdered most of these guys, so you can just retreat. And have my battering rams just just maybe destroy this tower here so I can enter 
the north of their city here safely-ish. And oh, there's more guys, that's okay. But we might need some more siege agents here. Let's maybe get a couple more of you. Yeah, we don't have to worry about gold too much now because once we have once we have destroyed their wonder and stuff, then we'll, we'll be good anyway. So you just go north here. I wonder whether destroying the market gets me anything here. We'll have to see. You just run away here. You destroy this. And I don't think they have that many defenses inside the city anyway. Monks, you can do some more healing. And I should probably do a little bit of scouting here. You can do that. Let's find out where, out where their castle and where their wonder are. There's the castle. So let's just avoid you for now. Otherwise you're going to destroy me. And instead you will destroy the castle. And you just hang around here for a little bit. Yeah, I'm not going to rush the castle. We're not in that much of a hurry. And after that is done, I don't think I really needed all these castle upgrades that I got because they never really attacked my castle anyway. All they really did was just run into it then instantaneously be killed. Which is fair because I had a lot of cavalry archers in there, so you kill this guy. They still have these guys here left. That's just not cool, but oh well. Oh, you, at least you're not attacking my battering rams, so that's that's something, I guess. They still have a lot of these guys here left, but it's it's okay. So you destroy that guy. Yeah, there we go. Oh, there's still have a monk left. That's okay. No worries. I can throw I can throw a lot of fi firepower at whatever they have left here. There we go. This one here is no, not quite half. Well, two ones is probably more than a third, like a third down, but that's fine. Just going to have them sort this one here out. And we do have more of them. That's nice. You can join in here. You might even arrive before this is over. And yeah, you just burn down some buildings if you really want to. It's not that necessary. And it might even be detrimental if you accidentally get too close to those towers, but whatever. Okay, so this castle here is almost down. I'm not quite sure whether destroying the castle gets me anything. But we shall see. Oh hey, I forgot that someone was inside there. I guess you can, can join the, the next battering ram here. So was this my original battering ram? Maybe it was. Anyway, let's just continue. You can come down here. No, you must not destroy our wonder, the cornerstone of our city. Take this, please, and leave. It's not quite enough. You should just give me a little bit more, then I would have left you alone. Also. They actually called a wonder. It was like a capitalized, with capitalized W. So talk about breaking the fourth wall here. Anyway, let's destroy the wonder. Yeah, I'm not quite sure whether building a fleet would have been faster, but at least I think this is a more fun way to do it. So you make some space for the battering ramps here, and then we're going to blow up their wonder. It's going to give us a nice, nice amount of gold. And at this point, we could probably destroy the entire city. All right, that wasn't so bad actually. Just do it. Just take it slow. Do it systematically, and everything's going to be fine. Boom. And that's it. Thanks for watching, and see you next time. Was this man, I asked, to threaten the Roman Emperor? Titles such as Emperor meant nothing to Huns. Attila was not an appointed ruler, only the strongest among the Huns. The amenities of his office meant nothing to him. While his chieftains and council ate off of silver plates, Attila's own plate and goblet were hewn from simple wood. His Scythian garbs had jewels on their sword hilts, and their cloaks were clasped with gold. 
but Attila showed no such affectations. He was interested only in conquest. Some said that he was trying to build a legacy to rival that of Alexander the Great. All of the barbarians wanted to possess Rome, as if it would buy them instant legitimacy as a world-spanning empire. Unlike most of the other barbarians, however, Attila was actually going to get his chance. <laughs>